Our first group of students are off to a fitting session. Driving any single-seat race car means more than hopping in and sliding the seat about until you're comfortable. Like a good suit, the car has to be fitted to you. And it's a tight fit. There's not much room to manoeuvre inside, but getting everything in the right place is critical if the driver is to keep control and to feel everything that the car is doing underneath them. Measurements are taken and recorded for the distance from the pedals and steering wheel and the process goes on until the instructors and mechanics are happy that they've got it right. OK, Hunter, your first car fitting, how was it? Uh, I was a bit surprised actually, it's, um, it's very comfortable. But I was surprised about the travel on the pedals, because right. on the clutch pedal it's especially sure. It's only literally got that much travel on it, whereas with a car you're talking sort of this much. You're a big lad, um, how did you actually feel in the confines of a single seat at a cockpit? I was very surprised actually, yeah. Um, so I was thinking it was going to be very, very tight, but actually it wasn't too bad at all. Today, what we're doing is heel and toe, which is so if you want to, when you actually brake, you want to be right on the edge of this pedal here, okay? So when you're on full brake, you flick your heel like that. That's it, perfect. Of course, not everyone has a problem finding space in a small car, and the mechanics have to allow for all sizes. Indeed, for some drivers, even in here, there's too much space. Uh, what I can do is I can bring the pedals out of touch. Um, a little bit different compared to carts how I'm used to. Yeah. It's an extra pedal in there, whereas carts is just brake and throttle. But uh, it's all right. I saw them adjusting the pedals. What was, what was going on there? Lots more feet, so... Right. I have trouble actually healing the toe. 